Welcome to Mrs. Moskowitz's Art Room. Um, today I'd like to tell you about an artist whose name is Edgar Degas. And Edgar Degas was born in 1840, 1834 and he died in 1917. And he's very famous for doing um, paintings of ballet dancers, of horses, and, and things in action. He didn't like painting things that were still and he didn't like painting posed objects. So um, before him and his style, there was a style of romanticism where people were pictured right in the middle of a portrait and they were posed, such as this painting here and this one. It was very posed pictures. And this very famous painting of the girl with the pearl earring by Vermeer. And of course, everyone is aware of the Mona Lisa by Da Vinci. And you can see they're all centered and they're all posed pictures. Degas preferred to do pictures of people in motion. And that's why he loved the ballet dancers. And you'll notice too that the main subject, this ballet dancer in the front who's taking her bow, is off center. She's over to the side of the picture, and then there's another story going on over on this side. You can see all the dancers, if you look very, very closely, it looks like a blur, but if you go further away, it looks like there's other dancers back here in the background. And that's how we can tell also that it's an impressionistic painting. We had discussed that before, that when you look at it very, very close up, you can see that it's just blobs of color on top of other colors. And then as you go further back, you can see the picture come alive. We should be very, very grateful that um, Degas' family basically went bankrupt because otherwise he would have been a lawyer because his father owned a bank. So um, when the bank went bankrupt, he was able to study art. And um, he was supposed to be going to school to become a lawyer. And instead of going to school, he went to the Louvre, which is a huge museum in Paris, and he copied the paintings there. And that's how he basically learned to draw and, um, and to paint, because he never took formal classes. This is a painting by Degas of horses. And you can see it looks like they're in motion. They're not posed. They're not all in a straight line. There's different things going on all along the canvas. He liked to do everyday objects and people in everyday poses, such as, it's not a very complimentary pose, but yawning is something we all do. And this is a painting of a woman, obviously bored, who is yawning. Um, another artist who um, did portraits and things in motion was Leroy Neiman. And this is a painting of Michael Jordan. And obviously he's not standing there posing. He's trying to shoot at the basketball net. And you can see too, it's also very, very blurry. But look at his use of colors how the whole canvas explodes with the colors and the action of Michael Jordan and the power. So Degas was never happy with his work. And when he died, um, he, was, he had lost his eyesight, so he wasn't able to paint or do much anymore. So he started doing some sculptures. And one of his most famous sculptures is The Little Dancer. And the little dancer is on display at the Philadelphia Art Museum. And she's around four feet tall. And they have her under a glass cube. And she is amazing. She's made out of bronze, which is a type of metal. And you can see her pose. 
and she did come to his studio to pose for him. In the back, she has a ponytail, and the ponytail has a silk ribbon in it, and the tutu is also made of tulle. It's not all metal. And you can go to the Philadelphia Art Museum, either virtually or you can go and visit it. And this is their website and you can browse their artwork and you can see the little dancer there. PhiladelphiaMuseum.org Okay, um, there will be, a, for the project that we do later on in the week, um, there will be a download that you can get of how to draw people in action with all the different body parts. And you'll just be able to click on that and have access to it. And um, if you want to subscribe, please push the subscribe button and you won't miss a single episode then. Thanks for joining me today and Edgar Degas. Bye from Mrs. Moskowitz.